let's see. So how much money do I have right now? I've got 8,600. Uh, I've already bought enough magic to tide us over for a good while. Uh, where can I go? I could go to the ice cave, but I something tells me that wouldn't be that good of an idea. Uh, might as well show off one other, and we got the Castle of Ordeals, which just getting to there is going to be a pain and a half because there's nowhere I can land anywhere close by. How far would I have to walk to get there? Holy cow, that is a long walk. I am not looking forward to that. Uh, let's see, there was one other... Ah, it's over here. And we got this place, which is, I believe, a library. And oh, interesting. Yep, this is the Library of the Ancients. It preserves some of the world's oldest documents, but now it has become haunted. I want to see... I believe, according to... I've, the README file also includes a walkthrough. And I want to say that's where the slab is, which I will need for stuff later. But I also remember that that's definitely not a place I want to be right now. That I would get my f face ripped off if I went there now. Uh, against my better judgment, I've been saying that a lot today. Uh, I know there's a caravan up here. I'm wondering what this place has for sale. Maybe something good. Maybe something required. Uh, dang stupid werewolves. Already put... Oh, everyone already woke up. Alright, good. Wasn't expecting to see werewolves in this region of things. That's actually rather encouraging. That's telling me that the enemies here aren't as bad as I initially thought, but now that I'm out here in the desert, I think that might change. But I made it to the... Oh! This place is a dungeon! I forgot about the that. Carabies? Yeah, and first encounter four ankylos. I think I'm about to die. Oh jeez. Yeah, I sometimes. Well, okay, I was able to get out. Good. Woo. That's yeah. That's not a happy encounter. Not in the least. Oh, really? The rogues and sand hags are out here, too? Well, uh, this is a desert. It would make sense. Go ahead and get the bind ring going. Yep. At least, like, so with the airship, I can go back to the first town and just heal there whenever, and I only have to spend ten bucks for it. Ten gold, pretty much, yep. Yep. As opposed to, I think the one in Crescent Lake was two hundred? That's crazy! Well, they always, they always get more expensive the farther you go. That's true. Uh, 
feeling experimental at the moment. See, let's see how if Bolt, if these guys are weak to lightning. Well, it does a lot of damage to him. Nice. Not sure if that constitutes as a weakness, but it certainly put a big dent in him. Is worried about you guys anymore. <laughs> Since I'm free to explore the world as I please. Nice. How much more is there that you think you gotta do yet in this game? Well, as is off, as is the often, often the case in Final Fantasy games, yet it involves four crystals. Though in this particular game, we actually are carrying the crystals with us throughout the entire game, and we're kind of restoring them to their previous glory, I guess, and yep. defeating the Lich. Uh, was helped us get clear the first one, so we still got three more of those to go, and then the final. Then the final dungeon opens up. So we still have a good ways to go, and the volcano is nice. Is the next one on the list. Uh, could I? There was a town up here, wasn't there? Yes, there is. What kind of stuff does this place have? I think this place has level 7? Yeah, level 7 magic. Stuff that even I can't use right now. And stuff that I can't afford anyway. But I'll definitely have to make a note that this place has haste, too. It's definitely the first spell that I'll be getting. Or at least oh, for nice. the first spell for myself, anyway. The, of course, uh, there's, there's also we got Cure 4 and Holy 4. Kind of interesting, too, that this town that you're in is only accessible by means of the floater. Yep. That's because this place has the good stuff. Yeah, this thing has mithril level equipment. Which I don't think I can afford I can't afford any of this stuff either. Oh my. So that's definitely something to make a note of for later. And the ship will still be useful later on. Like, to get to that one other town that I saw that it's either a long walk or I could just, uh, oh, it's over this way. I could just dock at the, uh, dock the ship right there. Of course, that would require me actually getting the ship all the way over there. Yeah. Definitely longer and the whole random encounter deal. Uh, random encounters, so lovely. <laughs> <laughs> well, they, they they serve a purpose. Yep. All right, time to explore the volcano. 
Ooh, going into the volcano. And, and the lovely thing about this place, damage tiles. Oh, jeez. This place is full of them. That's actually kind of surprising, because I didn't think a game like this back in the day would do something like that. Dragon Warrior 1 did the same thing. Oh, wow. No, the those the yeah, swamp, the swamps and such? Yeah, those were damage tiles, too. Yep. It's just that once you got Edric's yeah, armor, I, I, you were immune to that stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Zombies. So painful. And it sounds ooh, so painful. Level up. Lava. But walking on the uh, lava. Yeah. Yeah. Since we'll be going pretty much into the heart of this thing, there's gonna be a lot of lava to see. Uh, so how much damage does uh, the tile eat do to each? Is I, it like I want to say it like it's like one number? damage per step. I'll have to tell. I'll have to check. And fire. If it's actually only a uh, uh, one damage per step, then that actually ain't so bad. Nah, it's not that bad. It's, it's just that you're there's a lot of it. Mm-hmm. And wow, the fire doesn't really do that much damage for the moment. They might have some ability that can just hurt all of us all at once. What, the fire spell? Uh, it wouldn't surprise me. But there's fire elementals that I'm fighting right now. Oh, yep, I see that too right now on the stream. What's nice is that I have the warp spell so that I can actually get out of here rather quickly. And that's definitely going to be a thing I want to do because this one floor I'm on has a lot of treasure in it. Case in point! Oh. oh my god, silver plate right off the bat! Nice! Silver plate, nice! That is good! A good find! Uh, Red Giants? No, I don't think I want to fight you. Giving me the chance to run, I will take it. <laughs> uh, I wonder what, uh, what Aaron's defense rating is compared to everyone else's. It's probably pretty bi pretty bi a pretty big difference. Probably could be, yeah. And what do we got here? A bit of money. So, Aaron's absorb is a 60. Next step down is Adam at 30. Big K has 20, I have 10. Adam has 30, you said? Yeah. Jeez. So uh, yeah, that's that plate armor matters a lot. I can Im I can imagine that. And remember, my my last playthrough, I didn't have anyone that could actually use it, so it was pretty much just there for extra money. Mm-hmm. Is it still lightning in that out by you? Oh no, no, it seems to have. It's getting dark out, so I can't tell if it's raining still. But the lightning had the the lightning wasn't there for long. Thank goodness. Well, that's good. Hello, furry boy two 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 two. Welcome to the stream. Hello. How are things? Uh, what's the health looking at? Eh, I could use a bit of a boost here. Uh, we 
got some winding passageways to get to these treasure chests, which are no doubt guarded by more fire elementals. And red hydras. Oh, jeez. Hopefully I can kill them quickly. And in the meantime, they'll... Not use the mass damage move. The uh, red hydras? Yes. And thankfully it didn't. How... how courteous. Uh, I don't think I need to use the bind ring for these guys. Nice. I seem to be getting my all my hits in regardless. And what do we got here? Ooh. Studded armor for me. Not bad. Studded armor. Nice. So, what did that bring you up to? From 10 to 12! Don't I feel tanky now all of a sudden? <laughs> it's better than nothing, I'd say. Yeah, yeah. And, of course, the stupid Red Hydras get the first hit in. Uh, can I run from you? Before we all die. At least I got a heal too in beforehand. Uh, I read. I thank you. Uh, use two on you. Heal us all for some. Nope, this one's not guarded, and that one has money. Alright. Wow, big K, big K, K almost got killed in a last Hydra fight. Yeah, that was kind of close. Uh, yeah. I have fire. Fireworks on undead. Burned them to ashes. Well, considering that my all of my primary damage dealers in this situation are all paralyzed, might as well do what I can. But holy cow! These guys have a lot of hit points. I feel like leaving after this fight, just so I don't have to go get those particular treasure chests again, because those were things that I really don't want to lose. Mm-hmm. There we go. There we go, and Adam's back up. Adam and Big K are back up. Nice. There we go. Uh, yeah, just go ahead. Use warp a couple times, and since they have the airship right, right out here, I'm just there's a lot less risk with leaving these places now. Yeah, that's. That's actually really helpful, considering that you can just basically go anywhere and get healed. Yep. Get so You can see why I was so eager to get that floater now. It makes yeah, it makes life yeah, so pretty, much easier. Yeah, it was pretty good that you got it too, then. 
and it just makes travel in general a lot faster now. Mm-hmm. Plus, there's only certain areas which you can only go to with the airship. Yeah. So now, heading back into the second floor and finding more of the treasure. Do you know what the boss is of the volcano place is? Yes. The the original game referred to as Merilith. Uh, Merilith. The the U.S. version had to shorten that out to uh, Carry, I believe it was. Hmm. Also, Thug Kid, welcome back. Uh, oh god, there's a big room there with a lot of treasure. Yep. I told you there was a lot of treasure in here. And got a couple treasure chests here, too. So now the question is how do I get to that room with all the treasure in it? And I should have sold my extra, my extra armor, but while I was back in town. But oh well. I actually have inventory space to work with, and that's more money. All right, fine. Yeah, well, you know adventurers, they have strong feet. Of course they can you can walk through magma and only <laughs> only be singed a little bit. <laughs> or thing, thing, thing is there thing is there's similar dam damage tiles in the ice cave too, so you're having to suffer from freezer burn. Oh jeez. Although frankly in the original version of the ice cave, the damage tiles are the least of your concerns. Yeah, because I believe, isn't it the ice cave that has the sorcerers? Yep. And I don't remember if they are still there in this one, and if they still do the same thing. That is definitely a concern, but that is not a concern for the present moment. Since I've got this stuff right here that I'm dealing with. Yeah, the zombies. Well, just this dungeon in general, really. Well, the... Yep. Alright, so... It's just the... Big, con big thought is where... How do I get to th all those treasure chests? It's probably... This probably a long, winding path. Healing should do. Whoop, actually, have you heal. There we go. What the heck are rogues doing in here? Rogues in a volcano? What the heck? I mean, the last places that we saw them in were like desert areas. What the heck are they doing in here? It wasn't exactly a desert surrounding the volcano. Huh. That is curious. But these guys aren't hard to deal with, so I'll take the blessing for what it is. Uh huh. It actually kind of seems silly seeing a. Uh uh, pirates in a volcano. You wouldn't think you'd see them in volcanoes. <laughs> oh, I'd definitely rather see the rogues than the ones that were the next step up. I've already forgot what they were called. Uh, raiders? I think so, yeah. And the best thing about these treasures is I don't think any of them are guarded. 
But don't quote me on that just yet. These guys, these Zumbles have a decent amount of defense. Of course, when you get critical hits on them, it doesn't really matter. Heh, <laughs> yeah, makes sense. Die you, thank you. Uh, heal Adam some. So, what do we have here? Silver sword, silver shield. Hopefully, some nice stuff. Yep, getting good stuff so far. <laughs> uh, of course, Stud Kid would uh, quote you on that, what you said yeah. before about Eddie, though. Know? Yeah. But I appear to be right so far. Uh, a lot of potions. I don't think this qualifies as a guard, as a automatic uh, encounter spot. They probably would have been fire elementals if it was. Yeah, it seems like the 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 treasures are usually guarded with the with that. All right, and another potion. Ah, here we are, fire elementals. Yeah, I think this one's a guarded spot. Uh, you know, what? I feel like trying out the ice spell. Spell, see how well, strong this is against these guys. Eh, pretty good damage, about a hundred each. Not bad. Nice. Better than nothing. Uh, do a heal. It's the, oh, the lightning starting is starting to come back, and it definitely oh sound yeah, definitely the rain's definitely sounding a lot heavier now. Oh dear! Boy, that would suck to lose power in the middle of a stream. Yeah, that's that's why I'm thinking maybe I should end things off here just so I don't just to be on the safe side. And since I've gotten, I've accomplished a heck of a lot more than I was expecting to today. I wasn't even sure. I was, I was wondering how long it would take me to get Lich. Not to mention getting that plus the floater plus making all this progress that I've done. If it, if it, the lightning in that isn't that bad, I'd say you could still keep going. But yeah, it's it's usually sometimes better to play it safe. Yeah. If anything, you just go ahead. And Sell off my excess gear, save, and I think I think I'll call it a night. Go ahead. And good so at least I got some good armor and a weapon for Adam at least. So that's that's always good. Yep. Nothing else is Selling my old equipment is getting me a lot of money. Uh, let's see, that was the steel shield. The fact that I got this the steel uh, silver plate already—that I was not expecting. Nice. So did I? Is that all of them? Yes, that was all of them. All right.
Alright then, so I guess, uh... I don't want to commit to it just yet, because who knows what might happen, but I want to say the next day I might stream might be... It's either... Maybe either Monday or Wednesday. Because uh, I'll be doing my... My... As of now, usual announcement videos. So at least you'll know ahead of time, one way or the other. Uh... So I guess... Join me next time when I explore more of the volcano, and we'll see where I end up going from there. So, until next time, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day. Have a nice day, everyone.